So this is my mini haul at Target. I love Target, but sometimes I spend way too much. I really focus this time on not doing that. And I just got a few items. So first I saw these Fiber One 90 calorie bars that look delicious and they were on clearance for only $1.48 for a six pack. And then Annie's Mac and Cheese, I love but it's usually pretty pricey but it was on sale for 99 cents and then there was a cartwheel offer as well that i got an extra 50 cents off of um, the total three of them so it ended up being about 250 for these three i picked up some cornstarch i needed it for um, some meals i have in mind so that was a dollar 19. and then lastly this looked good it's the market pantry brand of like crystal light strawberry lemonade and it was a dollar 66 on sale so i just spent six dollars and 80 cents at target which is pretty good all right this is my haul from pick and save first i saw these crackers um they have like potato chip cracker ones that are white cheddar and then these ones that are like chickpea uh, garlic and herb crackers, they sounded really good. Um, they were on sale for $1.99 if you got three of them. And then I got some pizza crust. I'm going to make um, some calzones or stromboli, whatever. And that was on sale for $2. And then I saw these mini pizza crust that makes eight of them, the Roundies brand, and that was on sale for $0.99. Cents. Then I stocked up on some more cheese. Um, we kind of ran out this last week and I'm making my mac and cheese casserole tonight. So I need a little bit more and then to get through next week. So these were on sale. If you buy one, you get one. So I got four of them and that made them like $2 each. These McCain baby cakes, which I love, were also on sale that if you buy one, you get one. So they ended up being $3.49 for the two of them. Then I got some Asiago focaccia bread, um, which sounds delicious, and it was $4.25. Hard salami was on sale, and I got just under half a pound, it was $2.45. Bacon was on sale, two packs for $7. And then I got four apples, they were on sale for $0.99 cents a pound, and they cost $2.23. And then squash and zucchini was also on sale for 99 cents a pound. So the two of those were $1.43 total. So my total at pick and save was $37.79. Hi, Aldi haul. First, of course I got more cheese. Can you guys tell I'm a Wisconsinite? Those are $1.69 each. And then I got cream cheese that was $1.29. Yogurt was on sale for $0.29. Cents. I got three of those. A Just over a half pound of turkey breast was $2.49. Fat-free half and half was $1.89. This hot chili, it says sriracha on it. I know my husband's going to love it, so I got it. It's $1.19. Pretzel pieces, we got these last week because they were on sale at Aldi. The hot buffalo, they're really good. It was $1.79. And these also are very delicious, the guacamole tortilla chips, $1.69. Sliced pepperoni, $2.19. And then cucumbers are $0.25 cents each, I got two of them. The white cheddar crackers, $1.59. The This, a 12 pack of these, um, you know, toaster tarts, but pop tarts. <laughs> $1.49. I thought that was a pretty good deal. And then lastly, I love this bread because it's only 45 calories per slice, which is awesome. But it was also on sale for only 69 cents for the whole loaf. I think because the, you know, sell-by date is September 2nd, but we still have, you know, five days or whatever with this. And what I could do is put half of this in the freezer and take it out when we need it. So, in total, I spent $21.11 at Aldi. The total at Target, Pick and Save, and Aldi ended up being $65.70. And our meal plan for the week is Monday, we are going to eat from the pantry, whatever we can find. 
On Tuesday, I'm going to make Mediterranean orzo. I'm obsessed with it lately. Wednesday, I'm going to make pepperoni stromboli. On Thursday, we're going to have um, sausage and those baby cake potatoes. On Friday, I'm going to make jalapeno popper grilled cheese that has like jalapeno, cream cheese, bacon, and then cheese, of course. On Saturday, we might be hanging out with family and getting um, something with them. If not, I have the backup of making fried rice. And on Sunday, of course, bacon ranch pasta. So that's our meal for the week. And then for lunches, we will just have, you know, stuff from the pantry. We have sam stuff for sandwiches, things like that. So I hope that your grocery shopping went well and you found some awesome deals. And I will catch you guys soon in my next video. Bye, guys.